The latest way of passing safety net on your Android device because it looks like the games have finally begun. Hey peeps, what's up? Manji here, back with another video. And some of you might have been in for a surprise because all of a sudden, safety net has started failing. And this here is my rooted poco x3 pro which right now is running miui 12.5.4 based on android 11 and i do have magisk hide enabled and strangely enough i also have the universal safety net fix by k dragon installed and in spite of that my safety net is failing now the wallpaper of course is linked in the description of this video but before we get down to the process a few very important things i've read that safety net is failing for those of you who are non-rooted as well so please wait for google to fix it because this might be an issue at google's and they might have changed something next up all the files all the applications whatever we are using in this video are linked in the description of this video so let us go into fx file manager because this is the application which we are going to use going to main storage and now if i go into download you will notice i have a zip file so this zip file is kind of a toolkit which has all the files which you need which has been created by team files again their telegram group channel everything is linked in the description of this video so press and hold three dot menu on the top right and then say open with here and select archive extractor and then three dot menu on the top right one more time and say extract here and now you will have a folder with the same name and another folder inside that you have an application called x privacy and then you have else post and you also have redo now these two zip files here are magisk modules this is an apk those of you who do not trust the zip file i have linked the original sources of all these three in the description of this video so this here is your riru all you need to do is go into assets download the first file similarly for else post as well again this is the releases page and herein all you need to do once again is go into assets and then download the zip file and similarly for your last thing which is the x privacy lua this will be an apk file again go to the download page and then download the apk next thing what we need to do is we will open magisk here and we can go into the modules page install from storage then we need to install the modules which we have downloaded so three bar menu on the top left and then you will go into your internal storage then you can go to the folder where you have the files in this case it is the download folder inside that i have another folder and another folder let me change the view so these are the two modules and all you need to do is first of all select the redo module and make sure you get the message that it was installed then do not reboot go back and go back into modules install from storage one more time and now select the else post and again make sure that you get the success message and that there were no errors at this point we can reboot but before that let me open the google play store as well and if i go into the play store settings about here it is you will notice device is not certified so we can go back to the magisk application and we are going to reboot our device and before i forget if you get into a boot loop because of these magisk modules we do have videos showing you how to fix a boot loop caused by a magisk module which can be found in the description of this video all right so we are back into miui and let us go back into magisk and then we can make sure that the modules are installed so redo is installed and active similarly else post is installed and active at this point you should have an application called else post in your application drawer here it is else post is present open this and as you can see it is activated but there are no modules so the next thing we need to do is we need to install the privacy module so we'll go into main storage then we will go into download and go to the folder where you have the apk of the x privacy lua go ahead and install this once you have installed this all you need to do is go back to the application so we'll go back to our home screen else post go into modules x privacy lua will show up over here select this then 
enable this make sure that system framework storage settings are checked then tap on the three dot menu on the top right go into hide and uncheck the option of system apps again three dot menu on the top right hide make sure system apps is unchecked at this point the google play services should show up in this list so let me scroll down a little and we can find google play services so here it is google play services check this right and then the next thing we need to do is we need to reboot our device once so we are back into our operating system or miui next up we can go into else post go into modules make sure that this is enabled and you have these three checked so again system framework settings storage and the google play services now we should look for this application called x privacy lua and we can go ahead and open it select i agree herein you need to again search for the application called google play services and tap on this right herein we need to just check on this one use tracking just check on this one and once that is done all you need to do is go back to your home screen go to the play store application information and clear the data select clear all data and select ok and at this point we need to reboot our device one more time so finally we have booted back and let us go into magisk one more time and try to check for safety net again do note that magisk hide is enabled and here are the modules which are installed on my device let us check for safety net one more time and as you can see safety net is now passing let us also open the google play store and then we can go into the settings of the google play store and here in about here it is play protect certification device is certified this means you should be able to use your banking apps without any issues and in case you are not then you can again try to hide them in this x privacy lua and see if the banking app is now working for you and again as i mentioned in the beginning of the video the process might not work on all android devices or all android roms out there but it should work for most of you and there it is peeps the latest way of passing safety net on your rooted android devices and that will do it for this video hope my video helped you likes shares and subscribes are appreciated feedback and comment more than welcome see you when i see you